Hello everyone, uh, happy new year. Uh, this is my first video for the 2024 and we're starting with DirectX uh, tweaks. Okay, uh, I did latency and FPS tests. In system and I conduct some tests in Valorant. Okay, to have a sample in game in real time. Okay, uh, here we have uh, the DigWords keys that uh, I tested find if uh, we can get some performance from uh, these uh, big words from these modifications okay um, and uh, you will stay impressed okay with uh, my results uh, here we have of course the definitions of every single big word okay, okay uh, so you can check it and uh, understand maybe better uh, what uh, is the purpose of uh, it's uh, of uh, the word okay of course i'm not saying that we have the best definitions if you have some better definitions you can uh, let me know in comments or if you have any objection okay so let's go to the results okay the concept is uh, quite different i did uh, almost 30 tests uh with uh, windows performance uh, with expert and i analyze my data with windows performance analyzer as always I did 30 tests almost and I found the average. Okay, as you see, we haven't the three circles as I followed um, in previous videos. And the reason is because I think it was more confused for you and also for me. And uh, in addition, I don't think so that was helpful this procedure. So I changed the procedure again and I followed a simple procedure with, I think, enough. Uh, data to collect and analyze and make a more uh, reasonable uh, conclusion okay anyways we have system latency before after valorant latency before and after i get it with with this performance analyzer and expert and also i did tests in valorant in fps okay so let's see here all data together okay uh starting with system latency before and after we can see that we have an interesting uh, reduction in latency in duration fragment maximum and average okay but we have also in valorant a reduction okay in game reduction uh, in latency okay so that's it's really uh, interesting because the most times as you have seen uh, from the previous videos always uh, system latency it's different uh, from uh, the in-game latency i mean always we have opposite results okay so at this time uh, both results they agree together okay so that is very uh, important now about uh, the fps part uh, i must say that i was impressed because uh, as you see we have some we have almost 5 FPS improvement uh, in average and 1% lows however we have 5 FPS reduction in 0.1% lows and now I'm thinking the change of these modifications or, uh, these D words they change the way that uh, DirectX and GPU they working together and in extension how they work in Valorant in game so maybe uh, we lost some FPS in 0.1% loss to get some FPS in average and 1% loss. Uh, I guess uh, we must do more tests. Uh, basically, you must do your own tests to be sure about this. But on my case, I must say that I have some improvement. So uh, that means that I will use this uh, registry uh, to see if uh, for real uh, it's really useful. According to my data, uh, we can say that we have some improvement, not something huge, but also the most important, I think, for today is that we have some more FPS with these modifications. And maybe it's logical because uh, uh, these modifications changing DirectX and all games using DirectX. Okay, so I guess uh, it was uh, normal. Anyways, uh, that was the video, guys. I hope you enjoyed that. I wait your uh, thoughts in description, in description, in comments, and let me know uh, what uh, else video do you want to see. 
Thanks for watching guys and happy new year.